So now we can have oh, FPS problems there. So now we can have FPS problems. I'm guessing this game is not using all of my cores. I think it did need dual core. But it's probably not set up to work with quad core. English king and his infidel army. Well, I guess that was true. And all the Catholics came over and said, Hey, you guys, you're worshipping the wrong god. We should uh, totally make you worship the right one. And understandably, the Muslims weren't too pleased with that. And who can blame them, right? We should all just get along. I mean, it's always seemed to me like it was... It's the same God anyway, you know? Their religious texts are too similar for it not to be. Okay, so we have some of these investigation thingies. What is this thing? Oh, you're a dude who needs help, all right? Hi. That's not quite what I intended. Ow. Some more guards have arrived. I'm running out of health. I need to be able to counter. Counter is the win button in this game. Oh, you were supposed to fall over the edge. Hi. Thank you, my boy. I only wish my sons were half as brave as you. Yeah, there's a lot of that going around. Yep, can you stop looking at those guys? I've probably offended both the Catholics and the Muslims now. Saying that they're worshipping the same God. So let's throw the Jewish in there too. I think they're all the same God. From what I've read of the various texts. So we have to pick a dude. Well, pick, not pick a dude. Pick his pocket. Picking a dude sounds dirty. I guess that guy over there. But how do we get down there without looking super suspicious? Uh, not like that. I'm okay. Okay, let's, uh... Let's pickpocket this dude. Yes. I am to deliver the letter to your merchant friend. And you know who to see? The same man as always. Do not think to betray my presence in this city. We have many eyes, many ears. And many arms, yes. Good for silencing those who say too much. I know this well. You have my word. Good. Then be quick about it. Time is short. So that guy has an English accent, so he's probably working with the Templars. Hey, just get walking, guy. How do I do this again? All right. There we go. That was easy. Hi. That's still not the map button. Let's check the map. All right. So there's some. That's how you zoom. I figured it out. All right, so we can go chase a dude. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll go chase a dude, and we'll save a person on the way. Let's go up. They're coming up. Alright. Hi. Ow. That was aggressive. 
You really want to come up here, guy? Bye. Did you die? Nope. He's committed. Gotta give him that. Please fall off. Oh. Not you, Altair. Okay. We're more robust than him. Hi. Yep. Now, don't, don't tell the guards. So who are you? Oh no, what's happening? What's that icon? I don't know. But we have them as friends. Oh, vigilantes. Okay. Oh dear. Another flag. And a rooftop rumble. Chase. Is there a reason for this nonsense? Hi. Safety and peace as I hear. I trust you're looking for information to aid you in your strike against Tamir. Yep. I fear I've nothing to offer. Oh. But uh, but here, Mike, you shouldn't be too far from here. Okay. Rush. We're in a hurry now. Oops. Sorry. I slipped. Dude, you gotta get up. Get up. Hi, guard. Beep beep. There's another civvy that needs our help, but we're a little bit occupied right now. Get up the ladder. We need to take a sharp left. Uh oh. Hi. Excuse me. I'm sorry. What's going on? What's he running from? I'm not running from anything. I'm running for a thing. Not very good at it, though. There he is. Hey. Hey, I arrived from a different direction from that I was supposed to. An interesting choice, though not my place to judge. The Rafik has asked me to observe the souk that Tamir calls home. Here's what I have learned. There's a group of troublemakers who gather around its southeastern exit. They and the guards do not get along. Find a way to earn their friendship. And they'll surely be of service to you. Alright. So make some friends with some guys. And they will help us by taking care of the guards. You do that. Let's climb this tower. And then we, we should probably go and talk to the local assassin. We have to return to the bureau. We haven't been to it yet. But there's more investigations, apparently. I wonder if we should do those. Probably not. It's probably unnecessary. I guess we'd have to for 100% completion, but we're here for the storyline. 100% completion isn't strictly necessary. So I guess we can go to that. Is there anything I see on the map anyway? Make sure we synchronize towers as we come across them. We're not going to go heading for towers that are out of our way. But we're we're gonna get any ones that we come across, sort of naturally in our travels. Oh, there's a an investigation thing right here. Well, we'll do that since it's here. We'll go listen into a private conversation. Something caught your eye? Let's uh try and drop down here. Hi. And we will sit on a bench and we will listen in. You do not want to do that again. Oh, that was incredibly rude. I'm Helen. It's rats. No, it's rats? children. I hear them laughing. Rats, rats and children? children? Either way, it's bad for business. All that noise. Someone needs to get up on those beams and clear them out. I wonder how they're getting up there. Must be through the central courtyard. Then we should ask the guard to have a look. Ah, they're all much too busy polishing the backside of their master. Well, that's not too surprising. 
It was kind of implied anyway, you know, since they're there and all. Or maybe they only appear when you listen to that. I haven't gotten mad. I, nope. Dude, get... Climb the... Damn it, Altair! Why you gotta piss me off? Just get up the fucking thing. I don't know why I'm doing it. Because Altair is fucking dumb, apparently. Would you get up? Would you... Altair, please. Look. Just... Do what I say. Respond to the inputs of my thumbs. Alright. On to the bureau. I don't know why I had so much trouble with that word. Should get there no time at all. Here it is. Hello. Altair, it is good to see you. And in one piece, you as well, friend. I am sorry for your troubles. Think nothing of it. A few of your brothers were here earlier, in fact. Oof, if you'd heard the things they said, I'm certain you'd have slain them where they stood. It's quite all right. Yes, you've never been one for the creed, have you? Is that all? I'm sorry. Sometimes I forget myself. What business brings you to the mass? A man named Tamir. Al Muallam takes issue with the work he does. I meant to end it. I trust you have searched the area to better understand your enemy. Yes. Uh huh. Here's what I've learned Tamir rules over the Souk el Salah. He makes his fortune selling arms and armor and is supported by many in this endeavor blacksmiths, traders, financiers. He's the single largest death dealer in the land. And have you devised a way to rid us of this blight? A meeting is being Stab arranged him. at Souk el Salah to discuss an important sale. They say it's the largest deal Tamir has ever made. He'll be distracted with his work. That's when I'll strike. Your plan seems solid enough. I give you leave to go. Well, thanks. I guess. What is that? Let Al Mualim's will be done. Wait, what, 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 what was that? I get to go for a nap? I want a nap. Nap time. Ah, morning. So now we're going to go kill a guy. How do we get out over here? We should maybe help that person who is getting attacked. I want to assassinate, but I'm not allowed. Let's get down. And fight them downstairs. I guess we have to learn all these skills. Sorry, lady. Hopefully she's not dead. Ow. I was pressing the button, you bastard. Oh, there's more. Great. Get wrecked. Who's next? I did. Again, not the guards, please. Who are these guys? Are you thugs? They don't look like thugs. Vigilantes? Are they vigilantes? They are vigilantes. They don't look like vigilantes. They look more like scholars. I 
All right, we're clear of the area of all the corpses. Let's go find the dude we have to kill. We're going very fast so far. We should climb that tower. Let's do that. Yep. Yep. There's a fancy building. I suspect it's important. I don't know what it is. There's one good thing with the other Assassin's Creed games where you get uh, encyclopedia entries on important buildings. Learn a little bit of history while you play your video game. There's no reason why you shouldn't be edu educated while playing a, a video game. And there's not, you know, this isn't a, a mindless video game. You do have to engage your brain a little bit. A little bit of education along the way is not a bad thing. Unless you don't like education. In which case, well, I don't know. I don't think I've ever met anybody who doesn't like to learn things, because learning things is good, you know? Even if it might be boring sometimes. Like, school is boring. But you learn things at school. That makes it worthwhile. At least to me it does. Stab. <laughs> wow, these guys are angry. I only stabbed your friend. Hey. I'm trying to sneak up behind me. It's very rude. Ow. Ow. Gotcha. All right, friend. It's just you now. Feeling brave? We. Oh. I guess he broke his neck Thanks. in the fall. Thank you. I'll find a way to repay this kindness. I swear it. Oh really? That sounded more perverted than I intended. <laughs> Oh, it, wa it wasn't me. I was just in the area. Oh, the vigilantes are... Run. The vigilantes are helping. So I will make good use of that. Yep. Here they come. Hi, guard. You do well, I do well to hide. Really. Alright, this looks like the place. Not allowed to go up the stairs. Your men have failed to fill the order, which means I have failed my client. We need more time. This is the excuse of a lazy or incompetent man. Which are you? Neither. What I see says otherwise. Now, tell me, what do you intend to do to solve this problem of ours? These weapons are needed now. I see no solution. The men work day and night, but your client requires so much, and the destination, it is a difficult route. Word that you could produce weapons with the same skill as you produce excuses. I have done all I can. It is not enough. Then perhaps you ask too much. Too much? He's gonna get stabbed. Everything. Without you, you would still be charming serpents for coin. All I asked in the return was you fill the orders I bring you. And you say I ask too much? <coughs> you dare disrespect me? Peace, Tamir. I meant no insult. Then you should have kept your mouth shut. No, stop. Stop? <laughs> I'm just getting started. No, stop. Stop. You came into my soup. I'm glad I can't see what's happening because that sounded horrific. And dared to insult me. 
No. Leave the body. Let this be a lesson to the rest of you. Think what a nice guy. Tell me something cannot be done. Now get back to work. Get out of my way, lady. I have to stab this man. Be at peace. You'll pay for this. You and all your kind. It seems you're the one pays now, my friend. You'll not profit from suffering any longer. You think me some petty death dealer, suckling at the breast of war? A strange target, don't you think? Why me? When so many others do the same, you believe yourself different then. Oh, but I am. For I serve a far nobler cause than mere profit. Just like my brothers. Brothers. The Templars. Ah, but he thinks I act alone. I am but a piece. A man with a part to play. You'll come to know the others soon enough. They won't take kindly to what you've done. He doesn't look like a Templar. Look forward to ending their lives as well. Such pride. It will destroy you, child. Who do you call a child? I have a sword. <laughs> oh, I guess that was a feather. And now it's a bloody feather. Uh. Okay. Run. Please climb out there. These guys are very angry, all of a sudden. I think I just killed their boss. Oh wait. Kinda did. I'm not a heretic. Alright, we lost them. Get up! What the fuck, dude? Let's hide in this thing. Get in. Okay. We lost them for now. Let's try and avoid notice while we head back to the bureau. That's not a good way to avoid notice. I can't run forever, but I can try. I can't escape. Leave me alone. Just keep running out there. There are a lot of guards. I need a hidey hole. Just please climb out there. What the fuck is wrong with you, dude? You are the worst assassin of them all. Is there a hidey hole? There's a hidey hole. Oh, they fucking came up here. God damn them all. Alright, get in. Hide. You probably ran to some other part of the city. Oh. Okay, good. I thought they were gonna immediately aggro on me there. They thought about it. I'm home. I stabbed a guy, Daddy. Word has reached me of your victory, Altair. You have my gratitude and my respect. Thank you. I have feather. It's a shame that the other assassins continue to hold you in such poor regard. Well, they're jerks. Rafiq, I do not care what the others think of me. As you wish, Altair. You should bring news of your victory to Al-Malik. I'm certain he has more work for you to do. So you want me to go back to the thing? Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, well. I guess we're going to go back to our headquarters. Yeah. Return to al Mualim. Ah, I hate that part of the game. Unless we're just going to teleport.
Or are we going to do some outside of the anima stuff? Oh, we are. Out of the machine, Mr. Miles. No, I need to be rude. What's the matter, Doc? Miss Stillman is once again insisting I let you rest. Okay, I will rest. Can I use your laptop? I want to watch Netflix before I go to bed. Nope. Okay. What about her? Can I talk to her? So. Hi. You like telling me who put the stick up his ass? We have a deadline. One week. Well, six days now. Deadline. I can't talk about it. But you—you you just did. Put yourself in my shoes. I'm being held hostage by a group of scientists. At least I think you're scientists. And forced to spend all day in some crazy ass machine. You won't tell me what you're looking for or why you want it, but I'm supposed to be thanking you for keeping me alive. This is so fucked. Sorry, but it is. What do you want me to do? Hmm, let's see. I don't know. Maybe give me some answers? I can't. And it's better this way. Safer. Safer for who? Both of us. You know what? I've got a question I think you can actually answer. What's up? Why is it that sometimes the guys in there talk like they're from the future? The future? Yeah, what? I mean the present. Now, today, whatever. You've probably noticed that English has become the official language of the Holy Land. Yeah, I was yeah. going to say. The Animus is translating speech it deems vital into more modern English. So expect a few anachronisms. I could probably make it more authentic, but... You ever read Chaucer? Who? Yeah. Definitely not for you. Okay, that makes sense. Can you tell me more about Abstergo? Or what goes on here? Beyond the whole keeping me prisoner thing. Abstergo is one of the largest pharmaceutical companies in the world. Their primary focus is antidepressants. There's some information on the computer over there. But you already said this isn't about testing a drug. So what's the deal? I don't like where this is going. So it's safe to assume the Animus is not a part of their public face. What, you haven't seen the commercials? Oh my god. She has a sense of humor. I'm sorry, Desmond. I've got a lot of work to do. Like I said, if you want to know more about the company, take a look I at do. the computer. Okay. The telecommunication stuff is particularly interesting. Telecommunication stuff? I want to... How? How do I look? How do I use the computer? You said I could use the computer, but I can't. Is there another computer? Can I use this? I can use this. Okay. No, oh, that's what she means by telecommunications. I have access to her emails. Alright, let's uh So Lucy said to Warren, You said wind up like Layla earlier. What did you mean? And he responded, nothing, get back to work, please. We have a deadline. P.S. Why do you sign your emails? It says right up top who it's coming from. We have classified information from administration. As a general reminder, all employees of Abstergo Industries are prohibited from discussing corporate policy proceedings and projects. In light of pending litigation, you are all reminded of sections 5 Point one five in your employment contracts. You acknowledge and agree that Abstergo has developed such confidential information by the investment of significant time, effort, and expense, and that such confidential information provides Abstergo with a significant competitive advantage in its business. You acknowledge and agree that a breach of this agreement by you will therefore result in irreparable harm to Abstergo, the extent of which would be difficult to ascertain, and in any event, money damages will be inadequate as a remedy in the event of such a breach. Accordingly, you agree that in the event of a breach of this agreement by you, Abstergo shall be entitled to injunctive or other equitable relief as the court deems appropriate, in addition to any other remedies which it may have available. Should you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact your human resources manager. We thank you in advance for your compliance. Okay. And Lucy sent to Warren... Found your access key pen again today out by the parking lot. You really need to start keeping it in your pocket instead of letting it hang off your coat. Try to take better care of your things, Warren. Imagine if security had found it. They'd have shut us down for at least a day to reprogram all the computer access codes. And he responded, 
Great. Leave it at my desk. Worry less about my things and more about making animus work. Thanks. Nice. Okay. I guess that is everything. Aren't you we should tired? maybe just go to bed. Yeah, let's just go to bed. Good night, Lucy. It's been fun. I enjoyed reading your emails. Time for Betty Buys.